Hi, I'm Aditha Sitar from Laundry Basket Quilts and I'm visiting Fat Quarter Shop. We have done eight point star together and we play with some Y seams. And I thought it would be fun to give you a little bit close up on some of the Y seams that I like to do. So let's try it together again. This is our eight point star that we have made. And what I'm going to do is I'm gonna fold, and we already put one triangle in, but I want you to try one with me really up close. So we're gonna fold our star in half, pretending like we're closing a book. It works if you grab it with your right hand, close it up. Now what I'm going to do is pull one of the points back. It's very important that our seam right here is laying nice and flat. Now I have a lovely shape of a triangle, so I'm gonna take a triangle and place it right over. Why seems seem scary sometimes? Because we think we have to go from here to here really quickly. No, take your time, one area at a time. And we're gonna focus on lining our triangle from here to here. And what I like to do is take a pin when I slide my finger, I can feel the seam allowance under there. I can also feel it when I move my pin towards it. And if you open this back up, you can see it where you're reaching out to the fabric that it's folded. So this is where you need to put a pin in, just like this, approximately quarter inch away from this side and a quarter inch away from this side. And what I'm going to do next is take this to my sewing machine. In case the diamond is opening up, don't be afraid to take another pin and close it up this way, just to keep it close for yourself. We're gonna work on this area right here, sew it from here to here. I lift the foot of the sewing machine. Let me lift the needle to allow me in the right place. Okay, let's set it all down. I love song with you guys. I hope you're enjoying it as much as I do. Okay, let's go. So remember, from here, the point is under the foot. I'm starting right at the edge and I'm using a quarter inch seam allowance. Oh, this is looking good. This is looking good. Don't go too fast. And as I come to the pin, I'm gonna be pulling my pin away, but I'm gonna use my pin to hold the spot to remind me where I need to stop and I'm gonna use my back stitch back stitch two stitches that's enough just to lock the stitch I'm gonna lift it up pull it gently away from my sewing machine just like that I'm gonna clip the threads and I right away clip them nice and short I don't like them to hang long and look what I'm going to do I'm gonna now flip did you see how I do that? I flip the whole star to the back. The pin is holding all together and I'm gonna align the fabrics again from my triangle and my diamond. Notice the seam allowance right here is pushed away so I don't stitch over my seam allowance right here. And now I'm gonna set it up under my foot of the sewing machine. We want to get into the right spot, just exactly the spot where we have finished. We want to lower our needle into that exact same spot. And what I like to do is you can use either locking position on your sewing machine or make two stitches, lift it up, go back again and sew over one more time to lock that stitch in place. So let me make sure that my fabric is not sliding. Always stop, double check, line up your point, and let's sew. Oh, this is looking really nice. You have to make sure you follow your quarter inch seam allowance. This is gonna look great. As you're coming to the end, grab a pair of scissors or stiletto to hold the point. And now we finish, and I can't wait to show you how nice your Y seam is going to look. So look at this, notice it. We start here, we sew, stop backstitch, we flip the star, it was this way, okay? So start, stop backstitch, we flip the star to the other side, start at the point that we have finished, finish sewing, don't forget to lock the seam so it doesn't open later on, and let's go look at the rest as we open things up. So we open it up and I always look at it from the back first. So let me put this this way. 
and what I like to do is remind myself that the seam allowance is going this way. All of the new seam allowances will go towards the star and I gently finger press and look at this. Another Y seam perfectly set in for you. I hope this technique you can apply in many different eight point star. Tr started with the beginners, the one that we have taught you at Fat Quarter Shop. And once you learn that beginner uh, eight point star, you can do any kind of blocks. And anytime you want to do a Y seam, think about us. Thank you.